Good. Okay, questions for Stephen. Stephen, I know you weren't in there a lot, but uh, obviously you have a front row seat and are involved with everything that's going on. You know, what was it seemed like the offense had a hard time getting really in a rhythm tonight. Uh, there was a lot of penalties. What did you feel like UCLA was maybe throwing at you guys defensively that uh, you were having a hard time with? Um, I think it's you know they they played exactly how we thought they were going to play. You know, they played the coverage that we that we thought they were going to play. Uh, we just we just didn't play well as an offense today. We just didn't play well, and then thankfully our our defense is you know a bunch of dogs and picked us up and, and pretty much won us a game. And Isaiah Oliver had a phenomenal punt return. The, uh, sorry, the, uh, going into the game, did you know that, did you think you were going to have to play the second half or did you know that Sefa would probably be okay? I mean, I, I thought Sefa was out once uh, once he got hit because he took a, uh, an absolute shot. So, um, I mean, I was prepared to play the second half, but I mean, uh, he got healthy and got back in, so so that's good good news. How does he continue to do that? I mean, keep getting up. He's a warrior. Warrior. That's that's exactly how I would describe him. He's just a warrior. He just takes a shot, gets up, and just brushes it off. I know he's hurting, and he just he doesn't let anybody see it. So he's just a warrior. I know you weren't in there a lot tonight, but uh, comparing coming off the bench to, to starting, you've done really well as a starter. How hard is it to come off the bench cold in these kind of situations? Um, you know, you never want to make any excuses, but it's difficult to come off the bench and instead of like actually starting the game to where you know the game plan in and out, and just and you you've had practice with it and all that um, but you know just no excuses just gotta gotta be ready whenever your name is called up and that's what I have to do obviously the rest is good physically the extra rest you had before mm -hmm. for this game uh, yeah. did, it, did it take some momentum out of the team I mean with the penalties and a little erratic play tonight I mean uh, I just I just thought there was a lot of penalties tonight I mean I'm sure everybody thought that there was tons of yellow flags all over the field um, I mean sometimes the game goes like that and we just gotta just roll with the punches and do what we can do to get a win is the rest good and you'll have another you know long Longer break now until your next game. Is that good this time of year? Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. Especially coming down towards the end of the year, I think it's it's always good to get some extra rest. Especially the guys that are running a lot and the guys that are hitting a lot, like O line, D line, receivers that run a lot. They, I think they need rest on their legs, and so that's 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 good for them. As quarterbacks, we don't really run a whole lot, so we just kind of, I mean, rest the arm, I guess, a little bit, but not much. Okay, thank you, Steven. Right, appreciate you guys.